So probably pretty close almost, probably pretty close almost to exactly a year ago, we got this, we got this. And this is the Telesyn, uh neck holder strap for like action cameras. So you can use it for GoPros or I use it for Insta 360s, but it doesn't really matter. You know, you put it on, it's, it's, it's go has a, has a, has a neck band, you guys, right? Neck band that you see there, comfy. You put your GoPro or whatever on here. And then this little fellow wraps around your neck and you just snap it in there and you're wearing, you're wearing, you're wearing one of these, not like this. You could, I guess you could wear it like this if you felt like it, just kind of, it's almost, it's almost big enough to put it like that. Now it's a chin mount. This was fantastic because two things. Last year we ended up going to Disney World, Florida, over Christmas. And there's a lot of rides now and things that you're not allowed to have cameras or phones or anything like that. You can't hold them in your hands. So they say right on there, you can't do it because... Because of the way the ride jars you around or whatever, they probably experienced a lot of people being like, hey, here's my phone gone. My phone's not there anymore, you know? So because of that, they were like, no, if you have something that's physically attached, then you're okay. And so I brought this here with my Insta360 camera. Uh, now I wish, this is my wish, I wish I would have had something like the new Insta360 Ace Pro, I think it's called, because of its low light capabilities. There's a lot of rides I use the 360 cam. And one of my biggest issues that I probably shouldn't have done, but I, I, I learn, I learn, was I use the Insta360 with the 360 mod on it. I, my thought was I'd be able to turn it so I could, just in case I didn't get what I wanted. And because of that, I had some low light issues, whatever. I should have used a 4K mod. And if Insta360 ever is nice and decides, hey, we'll send you an Ace or an Ace Pro, um, I'd be, I'd be down, right? Anyways, it was fantastic. I had a lot of people ask me about it while I was wearing it because they're like, that would have been awesome to have. But not everybody has an action camera, right? Not everybody does. But a lot of people have, uh, smartphones and this, this, this is, this is their, their smartphone magnetic neck holder. So I think it's pretty much this but for your smartphone. So uh, let's look at it. So this is it, right? The model M&M, m and m, &M, m not sponsored by m and m and m and n double zero one. Could have said that a lot better than I did, but whatever. This is their smartphone magnetic neck holder. Very cool. My guess again is it's the exact same thing as as the action cam one, but for for your phone because a lot of us have phones. Now we are again going to Disney this year because my wife said that's the one trip she wanted to take, and she she loved Disney so much last year that we're going to go again in February. But one of the things a lot of us realize is that. Smartphones do actually really well if they're using their primary le their lens. You know, I've had this discussion with some people. I actually had this discussion just last week with my friend Jesse in regards to their action mode here and how good it was when there was a lot of light, but when it wasn't, it suffered a little bit. But that's 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 another video. Anyways, if you use the primary lens on these phones really really good that they're really good so this could be super cool uh what do you get you get so these here these little wipes my guess is this these are to clean your phone yes these are to clean your phone if you don't have an iphone because my thought would be see it comes with this additional ring that you would stick on the back of your phone if you don't, again, don't have an iPhone, so that you can use MagSafe adapters. So if you're an Android user, for instance, or you have an older iPhone that you're just like, you know what, it doesn't have the MagSafe. And that's not even that far back. I think that's like the iPhone 11, possibly. So this, like I said, very much like the other one. It does have a hand strap. I don't understand what the hand strap is for, but it comes with one. So that's, that's cool. Yes, right? 
Where did he put this? I don't know. I don't even know. And this goes on just like the other one. It's just a little, this piece here goes right in there. This one's a little different. So if you look at the old one, this one's got this padding over top of it. This one has access to the button that clicks. So does this have, oh, this doesn't even have a button in there. This is just, I don't know, cushion. This one has a button on the side. Oh, so they moved the button. To, I, I, I don't know. Does that make, make more sense? I'm not 100% sure. Anyways, as you can see from this, this, it's nice and tight. I was a little concerned how tight it would be, right? But it's, it is. It's tight so that you can angle it. And depending on your chest, you know, you could get this probably like pointing all the way down, pretty much pointing down, pointing down at your feet if you wanted that, you know, and all the way up and then this tilts back. Okay, now which side, is, are both sides magnet? My guess is this side's the magnet? Yes. Yes, sir, ma'am. So, not like this. It has to go down like, like, like this. This side here, as you can see, this side here is the magnet. So, if I had this on, first try, which is not always what I do, but first try, yes. And again, I'm not going to walk around with it to show you how, how amazing it is, but I am going to turn it on right now so you can see what it kind of sees. So I'm going to come here, we'll go to video. I'm even going to go, because that would be, you'd be, you'd, you'd want, so here's, I guess this is kind of the issue. I was just thinking about this, right? Oh no, I see, I see what you do. Oh, so you do do it, you do do it, you can do it, you you do do it this way, right? So, but you, you put it on that way. I was like, how does it see, where am I? How does it see the cameras? But it's there. So now you can tilt this down. This would be even great for those that are sitting on the bus wanting to watch YouTube and be like, all they need is to get this extended a bit more, yeah? And then you'd be like, watching YouTube. <laughs> yeah, watching my channel. Just let them go, right? Anyways, you got that here. I'm gonna hit video, yes, record. And this is using just a normal camera. I'm gonna put it like that. And there you go. You guys will see what this is seeing. So this would be actually really cool if you're doing like a, like a like a handsy video, I guess, or like I said, you're you're going up on the on the on the rides. You're you want a point of view shot. You just want something cool. And I'm gonna switch this for a minute. So again, I can just tip it down. I'm gonna go into like their sport mode, which is their, you know, you can go into like high action, which helps with the stabilization. M more light required. I get it, but you'll get more light in a second. So now you got this. And what do you see? Because this probably, you know, should be really nice and stable. If I'm bouncing around like this, and again, I'm doing it on an iPhone 14 Pro. Uh, you know, if you have a newer phone, then the stabilization and all that may be better. If you have a different phone, maybe the stabilization is not going to be as good, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. It it really depends on your phone. But the key is. This is there, and I like the fact, I was a little concerned that it would be on the outside, but I like the fact that it's kind of facing you, so you get a better idea. And I don't think this would fall off, because, like, it's on there. Like, it's it's really, and if you really wanted, you could easily be like, hold on, I'm just going to take a picture. Click, 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 click. Fluke. You don't have to make the fluke sound, but you can, you know, get it back to where you want. Oh, I like that. It's a little more, you know out there versus an action camera, people are like, what, what's going on there? But if you weren't using an action camera, the bonus of this, like, cause with this, if I have an action camera, I have to like unmount it. Yes, right, I have to take this and unmount it, take it off if I wanna use it to take pictures. This, I wanna take a picture, I'm just like, <clears throat> boom, take a picture. Okay, that's super cool. That's super cool, I like it. Um, I'll leave links down below. Uh, you guys can take a look because if you're traveling or doing any of this point of view stuff, super, super, super cool. I think I've said that before, super cool, because it is super cool, you know? Yeah, there's my hands, look, look at that. All right, guys, links down below. 
And uh, that's all. See you guys next video. Later.